Hello students, welcome to another class. I'm Franklin Baca and I'm a teacher at Superación Franciscana Secondary School in La Unión Olancho. I hope you enjoy this lesson. But before moving on, remember to stay home to stay safe. Lesson object objectives. By the end of the lesson, students should be able to use the verb will to make predictions and promises. Use the expression be going to to make plans, predictions, and decisions. Future. As you've learned in previous lessons, this is, is this is the word order for the future in both the the, the the sentences and questions, and these are the the answers, the affirmative and the negative. In the affirmative, we say we we uh we have first the the subject pronoun then the word will and the verb i will swim tomorrow for the negative we um we use first the subject then the the negative of will which is one and then the verb and for the question first comes the, the word will then the subject and then the verb will you, will i swim tomorrow and we have two possible answers. If the answer is affirmative, we will answer yes, the subject, I will, for, in, for example, yes, I will. But if the answer is negative, um, we are going to use, we must use no, I won't, no, I won't. This is only like, just like a review, okay? Because you, you already learned this in, in previous lessons. Now, the, our topic um, is to talk about predictions based on our opinion. So when, when, when we are going to talk about predictions based on our opinion, we use the word will. For example, I'm sure you will pass your exam. As we are making a, as we are giving an opinion, we use the word will. I am sure you will pass your exam. I love this film. You will have two children. We also use will when making promises. For instance, I promise I will study English. I promise I will study English. I will pay you back. I promise. I will pay you back. I promise. Okay, so these are um, examples of when to use the word will. Now we are going to study when to use the expression be going to. We have here that we use it for future intentions. Answering the question, what are you going to do? ¿Qué vas a hacer tú? And to make predictions. To answer the question, what is going to happen? ¿Qué va a pasar? So, um, as we were mentioning, we use the word, the, the expression be going to, to talk about intentions based on something planned before, something that we have already decided to do. For example, when I finish school, when I finish school, 
I'm going to enter the university. I'm going to enter the university. Ok, um, cuando termine la escuela, iré a la universidad. Voy a ir a la universidad. So, as I have, I have decided already to go to the university. That's why I use going to. By the way, going to, uh, when speaking, most people, I mean, most, um, when speaking, most people will say, um, in American English, I'm gonna, okay? But that's only when speaking, okay? I'm gonna enter the university. This would read, if, 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 if we were speaking, this would read, I'm gonna enter the university. I'm gonna, I'm gonna enter the university. But that's only when speaking, okay? Um, we also use going to, to make predictions based on evidence. On what I see, on what we see at the moment. For example, we have this guy who is about to fall off here. So we say, watch out, you are going to fall. Ten cuidado, te vas a caer. Watch out, you're going to fall. We have an example here. This is this is Sue and okay, she's Sue and 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 this is uh, sorry, this is Helen and this is Dave. Okay, Sue and I have decided to have a party. We're going to invite lots of people, as they have decided to have a party. They are planning to invite lots of people. Okay. Great, let's move on. We have this guy to whom you know you already, to whom I know you already know, okay? So, this is Mr. Bing. And can you predict what he's going to do in each of the pictures? Okay, let's see. What is Mr. Bing going to do? ¿Qué va a hacer Mr. Bing? Okay, he is going to celebrate his birthday. He is going to buy products. He is going to scream. He is going to eat. Great. Let's move on. What is going to happen? ¿Qué va a pasar? ¿Qué va a suceder? It is going to rain. She is going to make a cake. They are going to travel around the world. He is going to rob a house. Perfect. Practice time. Let's practice a bit. You will live a long and happy life. We, you will have two children and a dog. You will not be rich. Or we can also say you won't be rich. So there are two ways of saying this idea. Okay? You will not be rich or you won't be rich. You will not get married. Or you won't get married. We use will because um, we are predicting. So that's why we use the word will because we are predicting the future. We have another example. I, you, tomorrow. I promise. I'll call you tomorrow, I promise, as we are giving up, as we are making a promise, that's why we use call, I'll call, okay? I'm sure they married soon, I'm sure they'll get married soon, we are giving an opinion. That's why we use 
I'll, sorry, they'll, yeah, we use the word will because we are giving an opinion. What is going to happen? The dwarf is going to sleep. She is going to clean a flat. He is going to take a shower. He is going to shit copy in his English test. What are they going to do? They going to camping. Good. They are going to go camping. What is going to happen? Can you fill in the missing words? He going to an accident. Good. He is going to have an accident. What is he going to do? He going to TV. All right, very good. He is going to watch TV. What is Calvin going to do? He going to in his English test. Very well, he is he is going to shit copy in his English test. What are you going to do? I going to a okay. cave. Right, all right. I am going to make, bake a cake. You can say either make or bake. They both they both the same, okay? What is she going to do? What is she going to do? She going to a short story. Perfect. She is going to write a short story. What are you going to do? I going to a shower. Very well. I'm going to take have a shower. We can say either take or have a shower. What is, what is going to happen? ¿Qué va a pasar ahí? According to the image. He going to the bus. He is going to miss the bus. He is going to, meet, to miss the bus. Perfect. What is going to happen? ¿Qué va a suceder? What is going to happen? Humpty Dumpty going to... Humpty Dumpty is going to fall. Humpty Dumpty is going to fall. What is she going to do? What is she going to do? She going to abroad. All right. She is going to travel abroad. What are you going to do? I 
going to the escape all by myself. All right. I am going to eat this cake all by myself. What is going to happen? Perfect. He going to this race. He is going to lose this race. He is going to lose this race. All right, guys. I hope you have enjoyed the lesson and learned a lot from it. It's been nice being here once again. Have a nice day and goodbye. See you soon.